Effective feedback focuses on the future. Uh, and whoever's, uh, you can have some bonus points for whoever tells me what this is, by the way, if you can see it properly. Um, but the point is, it's about the future, okay? Uh, if nobody can guess it, I'll tell you what it is in a moment. Effective feedback focuses on the future, not on the past. So again, this comes in to, um, I need to give you some feedback because this, this, and this has happened in the past. Uh, thank you, Aaron, it's a flux capacitor. Well done, you got a bonus point. Um, this is what we've done in the past, but what are we gonna do in the future? That's a key thing to remember with this, okay? Give your feedback, you did X in this situation, in the past, it's gone wrong. In the past, we've done X, Y, and Z. In the past, you did this, this, and this, okay? Then we have to flip it over, okay? So what will we do next time? What's the future focus on this, okay? If you only give feedback and tell them what people they've done wrong, and you might sit there and say to myself, yeah, but do you know what? They should know, they should know what they should, they should know the right way to do it. They've been here long enough. Don't assume that, okay? And standards slip also. If I work for one of you guys, and I've done something in the past and it's not been picked up on, and then I've done it again and now you've picked up on it, then there's a precedent been set already in the past. So there's gonna be a fight situation there. And there's no good telling me that I shouldn't be doing that because in my head I'll go, well, yeah, do you know what? They're just not on it this week. I might do it again. So we've got to have that future focus in there. It needs to be in there. What, what do we need to do differently?